Hello everyone, this is Tatiana and welcome to my channel. If you haven't done so yet, then make sure to subscribe and ring the bell in order not to miss out on one of these fun videos. My client is back for her refill. The manicure you see here was actually done by one of my students. She completed this pretty blue manicure during one of our courses. My student used a color gel, so all of the thickness that you see is the color gel. I'll be taking down most of the product's thickness, but leaving a thin backing. Today's design is going to be really beautiful, and I cannot wait to share it with you guys. After I've taken down most of the product's thickness, I'm filing down the natural part of the nail with my nail file. And now for the cleanup. All that I need to do is push back some of the sticky cuticle with a cuticle pusher. Then I'm setting my nail drill to 25,000 RPMs, and with a flame bed, I'm cleaning up the cuticle area. My client has quite a bit of dry cuticle that needs to be cleaned up, so I'm cleaning everything up and carefully not adding a lot of pressure in order not to harm my client. Then I'm setting my nail drill to reverse and cleaning up the other side. I get many comments asking which nail drill I use, so I've left some links in the description box below to some really great nail drills for both home and professional use. Then I'm taking a pair of sharp, small cuticle scissors and carefully removing the cuticle. Then just to dehydrate her nails, apply a primer and a thin layer of a base coat. While the base coat is curing, I'm picking the proper dual forms for my client. Then I'm coating her nails in a thin layer of a milky builder gel. When applying the gel, I use a number 4 brush. After letting that cure, I'm measuring the dual forms against her nails. 
for our design, I'll need quite a bit of space by the apex. And now for our design, I'm really excited about this one. I'm taking a clear poly gel, applying it directly to the dual form, and then spreading it throughout the dual form. And now for the fun part, our decor. I'm placing a few larger pieces in the middle, and then sprinkling some small decorative beads here and there. Before applying the dual form, I'm taking a small amount of poly gel and spreading that throughout her nail just for a little more strength. Then we're letting that cure underneath the lamp, and voila! A little bit of gel did seep down, but that's nothing to worry about and super simple to clean up. Now just to get everything in a glossy top coat to really showcase the sparkly decor underneath. And here they are, I think they turned out so beautiful. A sparkly, super decorative, and unusual manicure complete. What do you guys think? Let me know down in the comments section below. If you liked this video, then please give it a big thumbs up, and until next time.